It is what it is. But if you're grading raw amber, you always want to avoid the cracks. If you're buying polished amber, it's okay. Jake Dog 10, I do have blue amber. Yes, I do. I got a pretty big piece. Thanks for the shares, guys. Thanks for the roses. Ugh. Blue amber. This is not, not Colombian insects. So this piece, for example, this is a very large raw piece of blue amber. Check this out. Major blessings, there is such a thing as green amber, and it's probably my favorite of all ambers. Oof. Oof. Big, beautiful, raw piece of blue. Let me just zoom in a little bit. Dominican blue. So this is like a very big piece, and uh, this one's... It's rare to find this big of blue amber. And it's like, it's pretty blue all over. Ooh, the other side's blue too. It doesn't have a, um, it doesn't have a perfect polish. It's just windows. 180, yeah, the major blessings. I'll show you what the green amber looks like right now. Green amber. Nobody, no, nobody on the internet has um, green amber like I do because it's a complicated issue and it's not that simple. Me